Hi, everybody. We're back. This is Dave Vellante. This is The Cube, and we're here at the Tug event with Justin Borgman, who's the CEO of Adapt, uh, Cube alum. Justin, welcome back. Good to see you again. Thanks, Dave. Great to be here. So we saw you at Hack Reduce, which was right after Strata. You guys won the best in show at Strata. That must have felt really good, but you come home, and it's like, all right, now we really got to get to work. So give us an update. What's been going on since the fall? Yeah, I mean, I think for us now, it's all about execution. Uh, you know, we're really excited about the way the market has taken to this notion of doing SQL analytics on Hadoop. And I think, you know, increasingly you see others in the market now pursuing that strategy. And that's that's only going to drive more interest, I think, in the customer, com customer community. So we now have customers in financial services, in the internet space, doing customer behavior analytics, web analytics, using our platform as a way to work with both structured and unstructured data, all based in, in, on Hadoop. And so it's it's really gratifying, I think, to see you know how far we've come from the humble beginnings we had at, at Yale spinning out of that research to now being you know actually in production with r real customers. Okay, so you're shipping in production. We are. You're out of beta. Yep. Is that right? That's correct. Yep. Okay, good. So I mean, you guys, you know, there was there was this little uh, I'll call it a urinary Olympics going on between Impala and Adapt. Um, word is those guys are still in private beta. But you can confirm here on theCUBE that you are in production, shipping, you've got real customers. We absolutely do, we absolutely do. Outstanding, so talk a little bit more about how they envision using the, the platform and how it's going to affect their business. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, most of our customers are folks that have already bought into the notion of Hadoop being an important aspect of building out that big data infrastructure and being, you know, really key component to aggregate all of that data, structured and unstructured data. And so that's that's really the way we call, qualify our customers. Do they know what Hadoop is? Are they already bought into the notion of, you know, this is going to save them money, it's going to allow them to do new kinds of analytics and an ability to store all of their data? And at that point, you know, we basically help them accelerate that into production. So a lot of our customers are people that have played with Hadoop in an experimental environment and are now looking to do something really real with it, something that's going to deliver real business value. And in order to do that, that's where SQL becomes increasingly valuable as a bridge between this new world and all the legacy tools and applications that they built and the skill sets that they have today. So where would you say they are? They've obviously kicked the tires. They've sort of played around it, maybe made a business case. Yep. Have they figured out how to actually monetize it, make money at it, get competitive advantage, save lives? You know, where are we at in that spectrum? Yeah, I mean, I think the early adopters absolutely have. So, you know, a little bit uh, later this quarter, we'll, we'll start to talk about some of the customers that are actually using our platform. And you'll find that there are internet companies, software as a service based companies that are using our platform to actually drive new revenue. Things like, you know, how do I convert customers from my sort of entry level product to my more premium product? Uh, how do I tie in uh, social media and, and blogs and frequently asked questions and tie all of that into the analysis of how people are using my platform? So it's now able to actually deliver real revenue, which ultimately you know, is, is benefiting the bottom line at the end of the day. I want to go back to the platform a bit. So we had Ming, Ming Sheng Hong on the, uh, on the Cube, gave us a great demo, yep. and then he came back to our, our office in Marlboro and really we got into it. We talked about some of the unique aspects of the platform, specifically things like user-defined queries, the integration of things like Tableau, some of that rich function. And it seemed like you had a market lead, I think, uh, you know, at O'Reilly, at the Strata Conference, and Hadoop World, that was confirmed. Um, at a high level, where are customers pushing you? And what direction are they pushing you, you know, functionally? What's on the to-do list? Yeah, I mean, I think increasing support of different tools is something that's interesting. People want to use R, people want to use SaaS, people want to use Tableau, Pentaho, MicroStrategy, Cognos Business Objects. We intend to be able to support all of these uh, in the near future. Uh, and by building a standard SQL interface, rather than something like HiveQL, we're able to actually you know, deliver on that vision. Um, so, you know, that's an area that we see increased interest. And also, again, you know, how can I make this easier to consume for the business analyst? I think that's another important theme that we're really trying to, to drive off. So that's really important what you said about the SQL interface because that allows you to scale without having to tick off all these integration capabilities, you know, one at a time. And, right. you know, you're CEO, you got a limited R&D budget to spend. Right. Absolutely. Yeah, so, um, Okay, good. So let's talk about kind of what's next uh, for Hadapt. I mean, event-wise, um, what's on your you know, sort of 2013 priority list? Yeah, so we'll be doing a number of the same conferences that I know we'll see you guys at, Strata, uh, Gigom as well, um, uh, the, the Gartner BI Summit I know we'll be at. So I think that's all in the, the first half of this year. 
Uh, and we'll also be participating in increasing numbers of uh, Hanuk meetup groups, which we find actually to be really good. I was just at one in New York uh, at Bloomberg uh, about a week and a half ago, uh, meeting with a lot of interesting folks, doing real things with Hadoop. And I think that's a great way for us to reach out and talk to Hadoop enthusiasts directly and find out the kinds of things that they're trying to do with, with Hadoop. Now, awesome. You mentioned Bloomberg. I think Bloomberg's got an event in April in Boston. Yeah. Um, and I think John Furrier is going to be hosting a panel. So we'll be at that with the Cube. Hopefully see you there. Absolutely. Justin, thanks for spending some time with us. Always a My pleasure. pleasure. My pleasure. Good to see you. Adapt, hot company. Keep your eye on this firm. We'll be watching. This is the Cube. This is Dave Vellante. We'll be back right after this.